Hey everybody, it's Party Lead back with some more Party Tech action for you today. We're gonna be trying out some new mechs on the battlefield and it should be a good time. Now, one thing that I wanna quickly go over before we dive into all of our mechs, etc., is that uh, if I take a look at my contracts, you'll see the only one available is one my rep is actually too low for and it's with the Federated Sons. So I'd expect, I, I, I mean, I would expect automatic entry considering that's my background, but hey, I guess not. So we're actually going to navigate to somewhere else. Now it'll take 12 days for all of our mech warriors who are injured to be, you know, patched up and for our mechs to be ready to go as well. So I, I was actually taking a look at some options here. And if we go to Girondas, Girondas, if we go here, not only, not only are we going to stick it to the Torian Concordat, but we're also going to get some decent three and a half skull missions over here and the timing more or less lines up. Uh, which would be nice. I was tempted to go over here to Brinton for the four and a half skull missions, but the timing there doesn't really line up. And to be perfectly honest, our uh, finances took a bit of a hit because of all the repair work we had to do. Now on that note, just a quick overview, uh, between sessions I obviously manage these things based on you guys' suggestions and all. So first things first, our grasshopper, now named the Party Popper based on a suggestion I got a long time ago, so thank you very much for that. So the Party Popper will keep getting the party started. Decker's gonna be uh, piloting this Grasshopper for us. Uh, we've gotten rid of some of the LRMs and uh, we're getting some L Laser Plus Pluses. We're getting a lot of M Lasers and I've gotten a uh, double heat sink as well, hoping to keep uh, heat manageable here. Hoping to hop in, get shots in with all of these lasers and then hop out. Again, Decker's gonna be in there, so he's gonna have Ace Pilot and stuff as well. We'll see how we can use it, but I think it's a viable, uh, I think it's a viable mech still. Uh, then we've got the Highlander being repaired, just a lot of repair work going on. We had a broken component as well. We've got the Catapult being repaired, just some repairs going on over here. And the Awesome is actually not going to make it to our next mission. I've uh, I've got some repairs going on and a lot of our, you know, replacements and stuff going on as well, installing some new equipment for the replaced and broken pieces, and the Orion as well, 37 days away. Uh, so it's a little sad to say goodbye to the Orion, but that's okay because we do have a Zeus that I'd like to test out. So this upcoming mission in, you know, 11 or 12 days or so, I guess, uh, we'll have the Party Popper, the Highlander, the Catapult, and the Zeus. And I think we should be able to pull it off. We'll see what kind of a challenge we get. There is this other awesome as well that I can look into using, but uh, now nah, I think we've got a good set going on. So. Without further ado, let's set ourselves up on this star map for travel. We need to make some serious change as quickly as possible. So over we go to Girondas, or however that's pronounced. It's only going to cost us 30k. That's okay. Uh, set a course. Confirm. Yes, let's get going. Now, 11 days to travel. One day to, you know, get everybody healed up and ready to go. This financial report is going to be... A, oh. <laughs> Yikes rough one that's what i was gonna say now i could i could actually stay extravagant i don't mind that i don't i don't mind extravagant we've recovered from worst in the past i think so let's stick with that keep that morale up get rolling over here we're not going to do any engineering upgrades or anything just yet i do want to mention it was mentioned oh i'm trying to remember the comment now but i think it was mentioned that the next upgrade i should do uh was the drive upgrade not a bad idea because it reduces uh, travel time at all so that might not be a bad idea at all, but yet conversations in our Discord leads me to want the uh, the pool. I thought there was a pool somewhere. Yeah, but that we can't do that until the Gamma Pod is ready anyway. Nonetheless, let's go back over here and speed up time once more. Uh, another thing to mention is that our uh, Mech Warriors have been given some upgrades as well. Nothing too major, just a couple small upgrades here and there, spending some XP. Uh, the, big, the big difference is that Party Elite uh, got three pips under piloting because uh, he was way behind on piloting and so now he'll be able to move faster He'll get melee hits in more often things like that. So uh, I figured I should play some catch up there get a nice well-rounded mech warrior uh, That's kind of my thinking across the board really if I'm perfectly honest and hopefully that works out Hopefully that works out for this mission last mission was uh, Man, we were severely outnumbered. We had to eject Decker more or less right away in that one So I have to be a bit more cautious be just a bit more cautious and we'll be fine i'm not too nervous we've got some high tier mechs going on uh, let's just take a quick peek at the store over here see if there's anything interesting to be bought Ooh, a flamer plus extra damage um any any gyros or anything any double heat sinks and nothing wow this is actually pretty 
boring system as far as the store is concerned. What do we have in terms of not my Mac Warriors, my contracts? What have we got here? What have we got? Oh, don't tell me nothing. Come on, load on up. There we go. Ooh. Oh, man. Well, hopefully this stuff can help me get uh, my rep up. Again, rep actually matters now, so we'll we'll keep an eye out for that. Both of these missions are on desert type. Uh, it's okay. We'll have a good time. We're going to take this settling a grudge, but again, it's a day until we can actually do that. Let's wait for everybody to be healed up. So one more day. There we go. Everyone's returned except for Party Elite. I don't necessarily want to wait another 12 days. Because we can take trouble instead of party elite, we'll be fine. Standing by. Not the highest tier mech warrior. Standing by. Yes, commander. But uh, I commander. think we'll manage. We'll manage with trouble, glitch, Decker, and Behemoth. Medusa again, yes, not really a viable swap out for party elite. I think trouble's the better I'm one there. You. So we'll sure we'll do that. We'll do that. Let's see. So everyone's ready to go. We need the catapult as well, please and thank you. Excellent. Now let's uh, let's get the show on the road. Let's get this party started, as it were. Now, as I do this, well, hold on. First off, settling a grudge. Within the last three months, the Torian Concordat has struck our facilities, personnel, and supply convoys over half a dozen times. My superiors in the Federation leadership would like to even the score. We'd like to hire you to find a Torian Lance and destroy it, to demonstrate we are not without military resources on Girindus. I like that. I like the... the the, like, aggression in that briefing. If they want to show military strength here in Girondus, we can do that for them. I need to learn how to pronounce <laughs> this planet's name. All right, let's negotiate the contract over here. Um, I wouldn't mind some rep, but with a mission this hard, we're bound to get something interesting as far as salvage is concerned. Maybe, maybe we do this. A little low on the cash, decent salvage, and a decent bit of rep as well. It's funny, this is the first time rep actually matters, I think. You know what? No, I, I need to make my money back first. Let's, uh... Ah, uh, you can always sell salvage if you get a mech from it. Alright, let's do this. Alright. Cool. So, unready. Lance slots require both mech and mech warrior. Nah, you don't say. Let's get trouble in the Highlander here. Decker. Let's take this party popper out for a ride. And let's get Behemoth in the Zeus. Is Behemoth the best pick for the Zeus? I kind of wish I'd redone some of this. Got the other awesome as well, but I don't think I want to take the other awesome. This awesome is kind of set up like an LRM boat. Two LRM 15s, a bunch of heat sinks, a large laser, two large lasers for when we get uh, in sight, but that's such a waste of melee damage output if we just use it as an LRM boat. 120. Oof. The Zeus, meanwhile, has what? 110, I think? Yeah. Well, let's, uh, let's take it out for a spin nonetheless. Hmm. That awesome has a lot more armor. Kind of wish I'd I'd respect this uh, this awesome. I feel I feel almost like naked without my Orion and the uh, and the awesome there. All right, well, 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 let's let's take let's take the Zeus out. Let's take the Zeus out for a ride. All right, I think we're all set up here. Trouble in the Highlander, glitch in the catapult, Decker in the party popper, and Behemoth in the Zeus. Let's deploy. All right, I hope you folks are ready for a rough ride because that's exactly what this is going to be. We've got, uh, well, you arrive at the location or employer specified commander. Move forward, acquire a target lance, and light them up. Keep an eye out for reinforcements. I get the impression these folks are a bit twitchy. Yeah, you, you don't say. But yeah, this is going to be a bit of a rough ride because I think everything here on my end is heavy on the lasers. We're on a desert. I hear ya. And uh, yeah, it's gonna be interesting. Oh good, there's some water over here. We're gonna camp out on that water as quickly as possible. Now, as we move ourselves over this way to engage this enemy lance, I just wanna mention really quickly, if you guys have been enjoying this series, please do not hesitate to let me know, as I've said countless times before, by uh, dropping a like and a comment. It does make a very big difference to how I approach uh, the content on the channel. And uh, yeah, if you'd like to see more Battletech, the best way to ensure that is by letting me know. All right, we just move up over here to the ridge and then hop on down. I want to get as close as possible to this water as quickly as possible. I'm almost tempted to just sprint up to here, and the next turn we can move hopefully all the way. So yeah, let's do that. Let's sacrifice the cover. Let's get the party popper. How far can you jump? Not very far, actually. But we can sprint you over to here. I want to get ready for like a flanking opportunity again with Decker. We want to get behind with the jump jets, fire away, and then uh, and then pull back. All right, the catapult. 
We'll hopefully be able to just stay in cover over here. Oh, we actually don't have range across the water. It's fine. They're going to be closing gaps, I'm pretty sure. Let's move the catapult up to here. No, let's move you up to here. Get you up like that. Coordinates received. And trouble. Trouble, trouble, trouble. We need you sprinting right up here as well. Again, we want to get these two in the water as quickly as possible. They need to be kept cool. And hopefully we can actually engage them on the water, close the gaps, and just, you know, beat the crap out of them while staying cool. All right, what's the deal here? We've got a 65 tonner. We've got a 55 tonner. So far, so good in terms of tonnage. So far, so good. Decker could move first. So we can use Ace Pilot. Based on what we've seen so far, we can still use Ace Pilot, which is neat. Ah, damn it. So Decker can no longer move first unless we use Vigilance. Fair enough, fair enough. Not the end of the world. Now I could send Decker a jump in up over here, getting some cover, getting good vision for everybody. Large laser shots. Mm, I'd rather have a full volley going down. I wonder if we jump this way, get a better volley onto this 55 tonner. Get it out of the uh, get out of the way nice and early, perhaps, before we start working away at these 55s and 65s. Uh, we could try up here instead. Oh, you know what? You're, if you're if your turn if you're if you're third in the phase, then uh, let's take care of you first. Plus, we're closer to it, so let's go. Let's get this party pop it. Wow, those evasive pips. 40% hit chances or sensor lock? It's guarded as well. It's a shadow hawk. AC5 I don't like. I could pop Vigilance to move first next turn as well. Um, hmm. I say we pop Vigilance. Use that morale up nice and early over here. Yeah, let's do it. So that way we can move first next turn. Let's fire away with a 40% hit chances. Ah, uh, what's life without risks? Question mark. Maybe we sensor lock for everybody else. Yeah, let's sensor lock for everybody else, and then we can try and pummel the Shadowhawk. I think that's the better call. All right, all right, Decker, don't worry, don't worry. Locked on. You're a champ. We all know it. You'll get your day. You'll get your chance. All right, good stuff. So now Glitch can hopefully come in here. I don't think we need to jump you. I think you're in a good spot there. You've got the cover. Uh, Bulwark from, from staying stationary. Or we could jump in and try to get such shots to the side over here. Uh, I think we can just shoot head on. I can't get behind. If I could get behind, that's one thing. But uh, I guess two jumps in, we could get behind this thing. Sure, why not? Sure, why not? Let's take those four evasive pips. Let's do the jump. Try and keep heat in check. But uh, I want to get behind this thing. If they're going to keep using guarded rather than uh, using breaching shot, I want to fire with everything, obviously. So fire away. And hopefully we can get behind and start ignoring guarded traits. Okay, good hits. What are you going to do? we got a Thunderbolt over here. 3M lasers, LRM-10, and an L laser. So that's reasonably scary. You're using the water already. Clever girl. I'm going to be doing the same. Oh, what have we got? 65 tonner. It's a Jaeger mech. Well, I wanted a Jaeger mech a long time ago, but now I don't really care about it as much. Oh, man. We put, we put Decker in a rough spot over here. Like exposing him straight away. Okay. Behemoth. Let's get you right in the water, and we can start chipping away at the uh, the Shadowhawk, I think. Again, we want to drop that Shadowhawk before anything else, right? Can't get into its rear arc for sure. But we can get up over here. All right, let's do that. On the move. Keep ourselves cool. This, uh, the Zeus isn't going to run too hot, but I want to close gaps with it as well. It should be okay for heat. Oh yeah, see, no heat generated here. Yeah, bam. Ooh, good hit. All right, all right. Good stuff, good stuff. Now trouble is up as well. Hopefully bringing the trouble for the enemy, not for me. Can we jump farther? No. We could get some extra evasive pips, but I don't want the... Um, don't want the heat. Right now, Decker has drawn aggro, so I don't think we're in trouble. Oh, the jump might get us just close enough, though, to hit it with everything. Ah, fine. If that's the case, then let's jump on over to here and hit it with everything we've got sure it's worth it we'll be in the water next turn anyway so hopefully that'll keep us cool all right with everything please and thank you 
<laughs> the Gauss rifle is so nice. Oh my god, look at that. Look at that. Alright. That Decker's gonna go in there and finish the job, hopefully. Ooh, they've got something here. Ah, damn it. Should have dealt with this thing. Oof. Alright, we're fine, we're fine. Not the end of the world. Decker, you're up. What's up, boss? Let's jump you right into the water. Right? We can fire the front of this thing, but... It is what it is, I suppose. I could pull back to over here. Hmm. Could pull back. Do I want to? Is there any good reason to? We've been chipping away at this thing. I stay. I say we stay focused and just try to drop it once and for all. I could opt to take the cover here. Not enough evasive pips, I think. Let's go up over here. You got plenty of armor. We should be okay. Let's go. Let's go. Let's hope for that evasion to do the trick here. We don't have... Uh, oh, you know, I could pop Vigilance again just for the bracing. Think it's worth it. Confirm that. And fire away at the Shadowhawk. Yeah. Affirmative. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. All right, well, we got into the CT. At least there's that. We'll be able to finish it off. All right, missed shots, flub shots. I'm not too worried here. The Shadowhawk's going to be able to brace itself, unfortunately. I don't know if it'll brace itself, but it'll definitely, yeah, not be as easy to topple over. And I can't get behind it again. But it's not getting into guarded, so that's good. It does have those two evasive pips. Could have reserved Decker, but didn't want to risk anything. And it feels like they've got a lot more mechs hiding out somewhere. All right, so Glitch, do we want to drop this uh, Shadowhawk right now? Or do we want to work on something else a little bit? Because again, it's that stability damage, right? Like the Shadowhawk does not need that much stability damage done to it. Maybe we chip or, or I could reduce its evasive pips. Nah, nah, nah. Let's work on something else, I think. Let's, uh, let's fire away at... Here I am. Moments ago, I was talking about staying focused and focus fire. Let's fire away at... Who's scarier? Let's work away at the Jaeger mech. It's got less armor. I think we can take care of it sooner. Ooh, 65% hit chances. 85 over here. I'll take that. I take back what I said moments ago. Fire away. Alright, come on now. Give me a head hit. Give me something nice. I mean, I'll take that. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Alright, who's gonna move? Who's coming at me? Something else off screen? No, it's a Thunderbolt. Alright, fair enough. In goes some shots. Missing the party popper. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, look at that. Decker. A champ. A hero. No mere man. No mere mech warrior. Oh god. This is where a headshot takes him out. <laughs> Ooh, not so happy about that. Alright. Behemoth, you're up. I say we fire with her just so we can, uh, well, I think we're, we're at the bottom. I don't think they have anyone, uh, any assault mechs or anything. So do I move in closer is the question. Commander. Trouble's able to get into the water, all right? Behemoth, Commander. do we send you further in? We do want to close gaps and, and cause damage in melee as well, so we might as well move up this way, try to close the gap towards the Sieger mech perhaps, and fire at the Shadowhawk. So yeah, let's do that. Unfortunately, don't have access to Vigilance. So do we stay put? Let's stay put this time around. We'll move next time. This will help with our uh, stability damage and all as well. And you know what? I'm a little concerned that I'm wasting ammo. Ugh, yeah, okay, let's multi. So we're going to multi-target. We're going to hit the Jaeger mech. The Thunderbolt, rather, with the AC-5, the L laser, and the LRM-15. And we'll hit you with the two M lasers. And then Trouble will hopefully be able to come in and finish the job here. I think that'll be worth it. Let's go. Affirmative. Oh, yeah. All right, okay. I'll take it. Okay, decent bit of hurt. And trouble. Maybe you get a multi in as well. Let's get you into the water, that's for sure. Get you over here, facing that way. Again, no, uh, no bulwark or anything, but should be okay, I hope. Let's multi you with the LRM-20. And I don't need to hit you with everything. You've got so little there, so let's get that Jaeger mech as well. 
Let's go A, B, B, C. Oh. All right, fine. Let's do this. Yeah? Sure, let's do this. Enemies Spreading that love a lot more than maybe I need to, but hey. It's okay. There we go. See? Yeah, causing some damage. Unsteady. That's good. Oh, yeah. A little bit of overkill with some of those SRMs, but it's okay. It's okay. And Goss Rifle in here. Come on, give me a nice hit. Beautiful. Beautiful. That worked out perfectly. All right. Now your number four, your Wolverine here is going to move. That's fine. Should work on this thing. Oh, wow, look at that. Structure exposed already on the Zeus. They've blown past my armor. All right. Decker, are you ready for this? Oh. Oh, you're kidding me. Just can't get behind. Just, just barely can't get behind. All right, where do we go with this? The Thunderbolt. The Wolverine. We'll try and wreck the Wolverine's day with... Uh, Precision Strike on the CT, that's 190. Let's see, we've got 1, 2, 3, 4, that's 100, 150, 195. If everything hits, we'll actually core that Wolverine right away. And you know what? I'm all about risks over here, so let's uh, let's try it. <laughs> let's try it. What's the worst that could happen? All right, come on, baby. Precision Strike, this Wolverine. Show it why we're called the party proper. Come on. Firing a full salvo. Aw. That was not nearly everything. <laughs> it's okay. At least we've dropped its. Uh... I've got eyes on hostile Ooh. reinforcements. They're heading your way. That's not good. <laughs> Decker is so exposed right now. Oh, that is not good. All right, all right, all right. We spread ourselves out way too thin. That's double PPCs. I'm not gonna like that at all. All right, good one missed. Okay. Right, things are getting serious now. Do we try to topple the Thunderbolt over? I think so. So fire away from where you are, hit this Thunderbolt, get it to fall over, and then we can maybe uh, call shot its central torso. Uh, I feel like I'm wasting some ammunition, but I do want to get as much damage in as possible as well. So fire away. It'll probably get up before we can call shot it, actually. There's the knockdown. Decent spread of damage. Pilot injury. Initiative drop. Okay, so we... No, we won't be able to move... We'll be able to move, like, one first. Oh, God. More shots off in the distance. Decker. Alright, alright, alright. Gotta get serious here. This is not good. Start on such a high note. Let's see. Where shall we move? Let's move... Up here, perhaps? You're guarded. We want to tr take care of that Thunderbolt, so let's move over here. Hit the Thunderbolt with everything we've got. I think so. Let's go. Let's take care of this nonsense as quickly as possible. Zeus is in some trouble. Still exposing that right torso piece. Alright, let's uh, hit that CT, shall we? 105 plus 46, 161. Let's try it. Confirmed. Nice. All right. Excellent. 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 Hostile excellent. Removed. Let's turn this thing around. Trouble. Order. You are going to move up over... We could jump. And get a little bit closer over here to the Jaeger mech so we can, you know, duke it out. And we can turn around and focus on this Wolverine as well from the side. Try to drop this thing. Maybe get its arm off or something. This will be its, what, left arm? Left arm. Mm. At least we could get that left torso, maybe, and get some ammo explosion damage done. All right, fine. Let's do that. Let's pop you up over to here. Optimal ranges. There we go. Jumping. Jumping for the evasive pips. Taking some risks on the desert, but we haven't overheated yet. And fire away with everything. Yeah, I think so. Boom. Let's go. Come on. Nice. Nice! Nice! Oh, that was perfect. That was perfect. Let's get this done, folks. Damn right we're inspired. Now, Decker, you need to survive, buddy. I got two mechs on us. Oh, they're getting behind us. I don't like this. 
Oof. Are they multi? Nope. Oh no. Oh my god. <laughs> that was very Good fortunate. Okay. Decker. Decker, Decker. What do we do with you, buddy? What do we do with you? We move you away, I think. We get cover and move you away. Expose your back to try and fire into that Jaeger mech. Sounds like a risky move. But I do want to get away from these three mechs, even though there's some long range capabilities there. Maybe we move over here. Face like that. Let's see, this is the left arm. So we cover the left arm from at least the Jaeger mech and then hit it despite it being guarded with everything we have. The other option is to reserve and let this Jaeger mech move first. It'll probably stay put and uh, and fire from there. So fine, let's jump. Let's move here. We're going to hit that thing. Water will help keep us cool, hopefully. Oh, did I seriously cack that up? I did. I cacked that up. Wow. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. All right, well, race. Gotta love the misclicks that ruin things. Hey, that worked out. So you know what? <laughs> Silver lining thinking. Let's jump on over to here, get the water to keep us cool because we are starting to get hot over here. So we're going to jump over here, face the right direction, and then let's get shots on that goddamn Jaeger mech. A whole turn of a lot of damage from that grasshopper just completely uh, flubbed there. But it's okay. It's okay. We're fine. Hopefully some good damage over here. Structure exposed on that leg there. Now the Jaeger mech's gonna move and fire at the Zeus. Okay. Ah, okay, that gets me nervous. That gets me nervous. Armor blow through. Trouble. Internal damage. Jump up to over here, get some shots to the well still the front arc. Or do we move, beh move Behemoth first and give her uh, Bulwark? 97 on that CT. Scary. Not enough armor on this Zeus, I feel like. Not enough armor. What I could do is I could... Move her over to here, get her further away from those mechs that are coming through. I can move this way. I can pull Vigilance. And uh, that'll give us Braced. That'll give us Guarded, rather, I should say. Only the one evasive Pepe. Sure. Let's try it. I, I, I can't... If this next turn goes poorly, I'm going to uh, eject her. Vigilance confirmed. And hit this thing with everything we've got. Maybe we'll get that leg. Or we'll go in the direct opposite direction of that leg. Come on, come on, baby, come on. No, okay, fine, that's fine. Trouble's up next. Trouble can stay put. Or we can jump up into the water here. Not optimal ranges, unfortunately. For the LRM, at least. I mean, we could do this. They're not within range. Um, it's funny. I almost want to move towards these mechs instead to get melee happening with the, uh, with the Highlander over there instead. And do something like this. Other option is to do this so I don't have to pop Vigilance. Though it will give me more... It'll let me move sooner. God damn. These options. Killing me. Yeah, let's do that. Let's get the Highlander going that way to... Uh, absorb all the damage that's coming in, hopefully, if we're lucky. Vigilance. Yeah. And let's turn around and fire. This time I didn't flub the rotation. God damn it. Come on. Come on. Nice. Oh my god. God's rifle is insane. Okay, good hits. Good hits. Enemies up. Who are you going to move first? It's a quick draw. All right. Guarded and entrenched. What else have you got? Oh, my God. I think we need to eject. Uh... Internal structure damage. I think we need to eject. We got a lot of things able to move right now. I could jump to the side of this thing and 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 
and hit it with everything. Um, Behemoth. Maybe you need to leave. Maybe you need to leave. 49. That's like one hit from a PPC. You know what? That's way too risky for me. I think we're going to eject Behemoth here. Let's go. Let's get out of here. Yeah, confirm that. Out. We've got this. Decker, Glitch, and Trouble have this. We're okay. Yeah, see, like, those shots, if they hit, uh... If they hit Behemoth in the CT, she'd be done for. And, uh, the last thing I want is to lose a mech. Alright, so what are we gonna do here? What we're gonna do is we're gonna jump on over... To... This side of you. Right, we can start working away at this leg, perhaps. Or do we work on the AC2 and then move in towards the LRM ammo? If we're lucky, we'll get an ammo explosion, actually, if we jump the other way. So maybe we do this instead and expose our back? Nah, hell nah. Not a chance, not a chance. Fine. Let's uh, go on up over here. Want to stay ready to go the other way as well. All right. As you guys follow me thinking through my indecision here. I'm going to maximize my evasive pips as well, which has me going all the way here. God damn. It's okay. It's not the end of the world. Hop on over. i got to keep an eye on the uh, damaged pieces. Yeah, let's do that. We're going to pop Vigilance again. It's funny how little I used to use Vigilance earlier and how much I use it now. All right. Hopefully we'll get the leg. Maybe we'll get uh, the arm or the torso piece. There's ammo over here as well. Come on, baby. All right. Okay. Okay. Not bad. Not bad. Inflicted some heavy damage. We're gonna miss with everything. I hope. Yeah. There we go. There we go. That Trouble. You're up first. I think we're gonna hit this Jaeger mech. I don't think we can hit anything over here unless we turn a bit. Uh, I could jump for some evasive pips. Get three if I pull back here. Maybe pop. Oh, we can't pop vigilance with you. Uh, in which case, maybe we stay still, try to drop this Jaeger mech. God, so many mechs coming in. Do this for the cover. Do this for the cover. Not enough evasion anyway. Fine, let's fire from here. Try and take this thing down. Oh boy. Come on, come on, come on. Give me something, give me something. Nice, okay, okay, we're getting there. I'm getting there. The Jaeger mech got very lucky there, so glitch fine. Finish the job. Come on. You've got this. What do we work on this thing? No, 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 no. Let's work on this thing. Let's finish it off. Come on. God damn. Give him everything Ammo destroyed, got. but not an explosion, so rough for me. It's okay. Quick draw's gonna, what, pull back? No, it's coming in. It's a little scary. I don't want it to close the gaps. We've definitely got range on the quick draw. That's why it's closing the gap. Decker, are you good for this, buddy? I think so. I think you're good for this. We can pop Vigilance again if we want to. I kind of want the evasive pips, right? Do you want to move up over here, perhaps? Get within range of that thing? I don't think so. I don't think so. Let's jump down to over here. Face like so. Yeah, let's do that. And again, I think we'll pop Vigilance. It's available. Keeping Decker alive. He's a vigilant man. Alright, so I could actually... I got a little too far there. Let's try this. Roger. Ah, just my luck. Alright. Really flubbing my moves with Decker. Really flubbing my moves there, but it's okay. It's not the end of the world. It's not the end of the world. We've got this. We've got this. We're playing with them. It's intentional. We're toying with the enemy. I'm guessing it's just the four mechs, so it's two lances from the- Oh! Oh, it's just a catapult. It looks so similar to the uh, the other mech. I forget the name now. But it looks so similar to it. Uh, the, the Stalker. That's the one with the double PPC. 
All right, glitch. What should we do here? Let's try and finish the Jaeger mech off. We'll at least topple it over. So, yeah, let's fire away. Let's go. Come on, baby. Fall for me. All right. Knocked down. Side torso destruction injury. So that's two injuries. And uh, a called shot. Would have done the trick if we could. I think it's going to get up first. No, 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 it's not. All right, we're okay. The Highlander's okay. Trouble in said Highlander. I say we turn you around. That Jaeger mech is going to move next, and it's going to stand up. But what's it going to do? It's got an M laser. It's going to punch. Not too scared. Not too scared. Now we can jump up over here. Get three evasive pips. Get cover. Damage reduction. And screw ourselves for range on the quick draw but we can mm, where do we go where do we go where do we go we could go here instead hit the quick draw with everything i'd like to move in and punch it soon right so let's move in over here let's do this hit the quick draw with everything it is guarded so it will retain Something. or rather reduce some damage we also need to be wary about the heat now that we're all out of the water. But I think this will be okay. Famous last words. Confirm. <laughs> that Goss rifle makes me smile every time. Alright, alright, alright. We're okay. Alright, now up comes the Jaeger mech. Gonna fire into the back of my uh, Highlander if it knows what's good for it. If it can reach. I don't know if it can. I don't think so, actually. Now, all right, good stuff. Now Decker can uh, go in and finish yes, the Jaeger mech off. It willingly came within range of me. We hit it with everything just to be safe. It's not like we're going to generate too much heat. Could jump up over here so that I'm able to fire. It doesn't really give me that much of a difference, actually. The thing is, it's it, it gives me the evasive pips. So fine, let's do it. Let's Confirmed. do it. Never underestimate evasion. Alright, vigilance. Never us underestimate damage reduction either. And let's hit this thing with everything. We've got no ammo to worry about. We're gonna stay cool enough. Fire away. Are, are you serious right now? Decker. Reporting critical hit. My man. What are you doing? All right, here we go. That looks like a head hit. Don't tell me we got a pilot injury. Oh, God, God damn it. I do like that you can tell visually. All right, in comes this double PPC catapult. Trying to ruin my day. Not succeeding. I'm a little worried about that head. The chances of it being hit are so small, and yet it happens so often to me. All right, internal. that Highlander needs to eject. Commander? All right, are we going to hit the Jaeger mech? Jaeger mech's moving next. So I think so. Come on, die. Die for me, come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go. It's about time. It's about Enemy time. Down. Please don't hit the Highlander in the head. Okay. This Order. really sucks. This really sucks. Like, what are the chances? What are the chances that we get two head hits? Everything else is fine. Like, do I take the risk? 11 hit points on the head there. That's nothing. We're losing our Goss rifle. Losing the LRM 20++. We're losing so much. The other thing I can do is play keep away. Let's try and keep my distance. Expose my back or something. Expose my sides. Oh, it's so very risky. And yet it feels so very worth it. What can we do? What can we do? What can we do? <sighs> this is ridiculous. Because Glitch and Decker versus four mechs? I don't know about that. 
I really don't know about that. Try and take care of the quick draw with like one precision strike into the CT. Okay, trouble. Don't you lose my Highlander. Hop into the water. We're going to expose her side. Taking a bit of a risk with this obstruction for her shot as well. But a precision strike into your central torso. Come on. Firing all weapons. Or we can do that. That works for me as well. That works for me as well. Let's hit him hard. All right, Decker, you're up. Oh, no, 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 this, this Wolverine is up. Crap. Okay. Uh, I'm bleeding, Commander. This is... That's frustrating. Waiting for orders. That's frustrating as all hell. All right, uh... Move up to hit the Wolverine with everything? I think so. Maybe draw aggro towards Decker, of all people. And we can pop Vigilance as well. Right? Does that sound like a logical move here? I think so. I think so. All right, let's do this. Let's do this. Hopefully we don't lose an arm or this torso piece. We don't have any ammo to worry about, but still, that's expensive. All right, Vigilance confirmed. Hit this Wolverine. Wolverine's already moved. Do we hit the catapult instead? Not like I can kill it. 225. I do not have the damage output for that. Got one, two, three, four. That's 195, right? I think, yeah. If I'm lucky. So, no. Let's work away at the Wolverine. The other option is to take care of the Wolverine, like, top of next turn or something, because it's already moved. So work on the catapult instead, and just hope to do damage. Sure. Sure. So many, so many misses. And, uh, I don't think it's gonna fire both of its PPCs, because it's heating up so much. At least there's that. Oh, I'm trying to hit Decker. You're missing? I think so. I think that was a miss. Glitch, you're up. Waiting for orders. What do we do here? Well, I mean, the catapult doesn't have any evasive pips. We could... Probably best to stay put, actually. Come on, baby. What have we got? What have we got? Structure exposed on an arm piece. Oh, I'm so very nervous. I got another Jaeger mech coming in. All right. Oh, dear. It's okay. It's okay. Not the end of the world. Trouble, you're up. Commander. You're kind of fine where you are, really. I'm tempted to jump you somewhere just so you get the evasive pips. And the cooling as well. I think we could do this. Keep a fair distance from everything. Maybe we do this instead. Stay obstructed. Work on the Wolverine here. Or maybe the catapult. Can we hit the catapult? We could. We could multi. That double PPC terrifies me. In all honesty. What's our range here? Okay, that's why. I mean, I could jump where instead? I could jump here. That'll leave us exposed to everything. I could do this. Expose my other side and hope they don't hit my head. Oh my god. What do you have, Jaeger mech? Alright. Okay. Oh my god, this is terrifying. Sorry guys for the uh, hesitation here. I don't want to give up all of this equipment, and yet at the same time I feel like I have to. I feel like I'm better off doing it. 11 HP. If I do this... Okay, I think we're going to take a risk here. Can't even pop Vigilance or anything. And I can just hope that Decker here draws all the aggro. Alright, here we go. Oh my god. 
This is definitely such a mistake. I should have ejected. Should have ejected. Let's hit you, and let's hit you. Come on. Got it. Please be worth it. Are you kidding me? Damn it. Well, hey, at least we crit a PPC, so I guess that was kind of worth it. Hell yes. Okay. Okay, what's up? What's up, Catapult? What are you going to do with those PPCs of yours? Yeah, I'll work on the Party Popper. That's right. No, no, no. Don't multi. Okay, good. <laughs> okay. Decker, you're up. What are we going to do with Decker? Does Decker... What does Decker do? What does Decker do? What does Decker do? Do we drop the Catapult? We could literally physically drop the Catapult. It's already moved. The Jaeger mech is up next. I don't think we can destroy it. 185. Actually, we can with a Precision Strike. With a precision strike, we can. Oh, I think that's a risk I'm willing to take here. Get behind the Wolverine. Sure, let's do it. Let's do it, let's do it. Let's do it. Vigilance as well. Confirm that. I can't precision strike now, can I? Shut down alert, damn it. A little bit of overheating is not the end of the world. Affirmative. The vigilance was definitely worth it. Over the red line. Heat damage. Oof. We're okay over here. Alright, alright. We're good, we're good, we're good. We're good. We've got this. Alright, glitch. Go. You're gonna hit that catapult. You're gonna make it fall and hopefully cause some more damage on top of that. Alright, maybe we get rid of this arm and get rid of the PPC completely. Maybe we get rid of this arm if we're lucky. Maybe we get a head hit. Knock down. All right, fine. At least it's gonna fall over. Critical hit, commander. Get that injury in there. I'm so extremely nervous right now. Oh man. Oh no 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 no. Okay, we're okay. We're okay. We're okay. Trouble. Good to go. How do we play this trouble? We can't hit the catapult, unfortunately, unless I move and potentially expose myself. I could hit the Wolverine with everything. If I get lucky, I'll have it. I'm tempted to jump even further. SRM6 AC5 M laser. If I'm lucky, it'll focus on Decker instead. Horrifying to even say that. Okay, let's try this. Yet another risk. Yet another risk. Okay. Alright, okay. Okay. Oh no, Decker. Oh no. I didn't mean for any of this to happen. Okay, we're fine. Reporting. Minimal damage. We're fine. Decker, uh, you move first. What do we do with you? Do we hit this Jaeger mech? The Jaeger mech's up next. Can I destroy it? Unlikely. Standing by. Other option is to actually jump away, use our L laser and all. Cause some damage to the Wolverine, but it's already moved. Okay, fine. Into the Jaeger mech we go. 90 damage. I wonder if we pop Vigilance here. Oh my god, so many options. I jump back, pop Vigilance, and shoot. We'll overheat for sure. Fine. We're gonna just punch the uh, Jaeger mech here. Vigilance first. Punch the Jaeger mech. Punch the Jaeger mech. Okay. Alright. 
Catapult's gonna get up instead, fair enough. Fair enough, gives us more time to take care of the Jaeger mech if the Catapult doesn't destroy one of our mechs. I am so extremely tense right now, you can probably tell because the rate of my uh, commentary has slowed down a little bit. I'm painfully aware of how tense I am right now. Alright, we work away at the Jaeger mech and try to drop it. That's my call right now. Let's hope for the best. Come on, how much how much stability damage could I possibly need to do here? No time for math, only time for destruction. So very close. That's a critical hit. What are you gonna do to me? What are you gonna do to me? No. No. Decker, no. Okay. Okay, we're okay. Losing armor. Trouble you're up. Uh what do we do? Wolverine? Jaeger mech. Wolverine, Jaeger mech. Wolverine moves first, so Wolverine, it's time to say bye, I think. Precision strike into that rear central torso. Come on. Firing full complement on enemy. Nice. Oh my God. Nice. Okay. All right. This is this is working out. We're good. Decker, you're up. You need to. Oh no, Decker's not up. This catapult is up. Oh, it's gonna. It's gonna. It's gonna. Oh no. Oh my god, Decker's still alive. Oh no, Decker, no. Okay, Decker's still alive. <laughs> this emotional roller coaster, I can't. I can't, guys, I can't. Okay, we can get in over here and. Punch the Jaeger mech, topple it over. Yes, Commander. It's gonna get right back up. It's gonna get right back up. I could fall back into safety. I get it to drop its initiative should drop from the knockdown that should allow me to pummel it with glitch well, let's try it it's coming from this side i think that's what this is i keep mixing up the sides that's right torso that is right torso we can probably destroy that torso piece um so here's the weird thing that i, I still haven't caught if I pop Vigilance now and then move an attack, will I still get guarded? Only one way to find out. Now's the time, I suppose. Confirm that. And we're going to come in from this side, please, and thank you. Let's go. Coordinates received. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Locked on for physical attack. Okay. I mean, I'll take it. But of all the places you could have punched... Alright, that's fine. The initiative drop is very helpful. Now, hopefully, Glitch is able to finish the job here. Okay, yeah, he did get guarded and entrenched. Uh, if we hit the CT, that's 155. Huh? Huh. Let's try it. I think I need just a little bit more LRM ammo on this thing. Alright, decent hits. It's gonna get up, though. God, 85 hit points. Is that going to be the end of Decker? Is 85 hit points going to be the end of Decker here? Oh, are we okay? We're okay. Man, that... Honestly, that, that party popper is pretty um, sturdy. Compared to what I was expecting. If I'm not going to lie. Alright. Time to move in like this, I think. Get shots with everything into the side. I want to hit the... I want to hit the torso. I don't want to hit the back. Is the is the problem. So let's do this. Engaging All right. Jet. We're gonna multi here. Multi hit. Well, there. That's my intent. Oof. I don't. Maybe the multi isn't worth it. Maybe the multi isn't worth it. Let's see. The Jaeger mech, if I hit from the side, if I'm unlucky... You know what? Yeah, let's, let's just focus in on, on this one thing. Live one day at a time, right? Come on, let's go. Oh. We could leg it if I'm lucky. Nice. Beautiful. Beautiful. All right. Okay, let's go. Okay, okay. Here we go. We're okay. Oh my god. We've made it. Somehow we've made it. Orders? 
Decker. It's time to do what you were made for. You're going to get in behind this catapult. You're going to shoot it in its back. You're going to pop Vigilance. Everything will be magical. Everything will be maj majestic. Here we go. Firing jump jet. It's going to be great. I'm going to use Ace Pilot finally. Vigilance. Bam. There we go. Boom. Fire away. Precision strike. I say why not. Boom. Got the angle. Take the shot. Yeah. Beautiful. Art. You know what? Glitch might finish the job. Fire away. It'll be poetic if Trouble gets to finish the job, actually. Which looks like it might be the case. Alright, Trouble. Commander. Let's make it very, very personal, I think. Let's make it as personal as we reasonably can without losing our head because of overheating. Come on, give me a rear angle here. Really? That's all you got for me? There we go. Still in the water. Lifting off. I don't know why I jumped that one. Probably the evasive pip. Whatever the reason. Come on. Roger that. Okay. <laughs> that had me a little nervous, I'm not gonna lie. Oh Hi. my dear lord. Excellent work, Commander. That should send the appropriate message. Yeah. Mission. I should hope so. Yeah, they gave us a bit of a fight, but we took an arm and a leg here and there, so hey, maybe we can take them. That's the message it sent. No, 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 no. That, that went well. That went well. I was extremely nerd. My heart right now is killing me. Excellent performance, Commander. The Federated Sons are pleased with what you have accomplished and the skill you have evidenced. Expect our payment in full. You're damn right I expect it in full. Nearly lost my Highlander and Trouble all at the same time here. God damn. At least Behemoth got away. So many injuries. These headshots, these head hits are really unfortunate. And look at that, the Highlander, despite having its head nearly blown off, got the most kills. Dacker, man. I think this might be the first mission where he's had no kills, apart from like the opening mission or something. Oh my god, my heart. I'm dying. Okay, uh, we could get ourselves a quick draw. We could get ourselves a Jaeger mech. I'm trying to figure out what I want to sell. Oh, here, here's the plan. We got a Wolverine to sell, and we got a Quick Draw to sell. We get a lot of money out of this mission. Ooh, or we get a Thunderbolt. What goes for more money? Thunderbolt's heavier, so I can assume, rather than the Wolverine, we got ourselves the Thunderbolt piece. Right, what else, what else, what else? Yeah, I think that's the best call. I don't really care for any of these mechs. Let's just make sure I'm not missing out on any, like, cool mods or anything. That was actually pointed out in the comments that I, I kind of glaze over the opportunity for getting things like arm mods. Wow, these are actually really impressive. Oh my god, these are... That's not bad either. I love Gyros, they're delicious. Especially when they reduce the stability damage I take. Um, let's go ahead and... Rather than make a lot of money... Oh man, I want both of these. What luck. What luck. Alright, fine. I'm glad I checked though. So yeah, let's go ahead and get ourselves both arm mods. Throw them on some mech that I hope to use in melee more often than not. Confirm that. No mech parts. Mm, I don't know. I don't know. I, 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 I don't know. I, I'd say it's okay. I'd say it's okay. I'd say it's okay. Even though with the injuries, we might not be able to double missions between the uh, the the financial reports. But worst case scenario, we take the salaries down to a normal state. We've been living extravagantly for far too long. I think we can take it down a notch if we need to. All right, Lady Centrella is ready to meet us on Weldry, Commander. I have filed a contract in the command center. Maybe the next mission we do is a priority mission, and as a result of that, we don't have to worry about money for a while. Oh, you know what? We should be okay. In 15 days, everything, including the awesome, will be ready to go, and we should be able to get another contract over here, I hope. Yeah, we've got uh, Heavy Lure. Not as much money. Oh my god, that's terrifying. For very little cash. But yeah, uh, we, we could go ahead and do this Heavy Lure. We've got... We will have, rather, all of our mech warriors ready to go soon enough. At least it'll be before the financial reports. So maybe we do that, get our finances in order, and then take on that priority mission. Nonetheless, that's all stuff to deal with 
next session, we have hit that hour mark. That was sort of a smooth, kind of perfect hour episode. Those have become a little bit further and, and farther between now, I think. But nonetheless, I just want to thank you all very much for watching. I hope you had a good time. If you did, you know what to do. Drop a like and a comment. It really does help me make judgment calls as to what I should do more of on the channel. Uh, I also want to give a huge thanks to all of my patrons for supporting the channel on a month-to-month -month basis. It really does make a big difference keeping us alive and running smoothly. I appreciate it greatly. And uh, again, thank you all very much for watching. Until next time, cheers.